there was uh, an expo that just wrapped up, World Expo, uh, the, ha the Shanghai Expo that just wrapped up on October 31st, and a lot of stuff was built for that, just as in Beijing. No, there were a lot of uh, developments in the subway system, uh, a lot of the infrastructure, a lot of the signs being in English, and basically trading with the West. Apparently the Shanghai Expo had 70 million visitors. Of course, by visitors, it could be one visit, it could be four visits, it could be 13 visits. So you can only imagine the scale um, at which Shanghai had people, not only from China, but from all over the world, visiting for the Expo. So here we have our morning coffee. We've actually had already some soup and an egg kind of thing. We're going to be on a train for Suzhou in a little bit. And that's actually, I'm kind of excited because it's a fast train. And even with all the developments, I'm just going to give the girls a little tip. The bathroom situation, you definitely have to navigate. I've been to other countries before where it's an issue, but if you're planning to come to uh, China within the next year or so, you have to be 